Hemostatic agents are the first line of treatment for a life-threatening hemorrhage in a situation where a tourniquet cannot be used, such as a wound on the head, neck, or torso. Hemostatic agents can also be used if a pressure dressing is ineffective on its own. When applied to a wound, hemostatic gauze helps to develop a clot that stops the escape of blood. Hemostatic gauze will remain within the wound until removal by medical personnel. If using a commercial hemostatic agent, follow the instructions provided by the manufacturer. To use hemostatic gauze, expose the injury by removing or cutting away clothing. Wipe excess blood from the wound while preserving any clots that may have formed if possible. Locate the source of the most active bleeding. Next, remove the hemostatic gauze from its package and pack it tightly into the wound directly over the site of the most active bleeding. More than one roll of hemostatic gauze may be required to control the hemorrhage. Hemostatic gauze may be repacked or adjusted in the wound if needed to ensure proper placement. Next, quickly apply direct pressure to the wound with the hemostatic agent in place with enough force to stop the bleeding. Hold direct pressure for a minimum of 3 minutes. Reassess the wound to see if bleeding has been controlled. If needed, reinforce with another roll of hemostatic gauze and hold pressure. Leave the hemostatic gauze in place and secure it with a pressure dressing. Once applied, hemostatic gauze is not to be removed except by medical professionals. Continue applying and holding direct pressure until medical help arrives or bleeding stops. No. If possible, keep the commercial hemostatic agent's packaging to be transported with the casualty so medical professionals are aware of any specific instructions.